Well, hello, Lord Yogi, I'll just see the gents here. Once again, taking you back in time to just a couple of years ago in the pandemic. But uh, ah, boy, Vinny here is looking for love in all the wrong places. No, he's looking, looking for love online, and it's time for his second date. Second date with Shayna has been arranged for tonight. Callum, the bedwetter. <sighs> Callum, are you serious? You're doing a hit session without me? Yep. Yeah. No time for slackers, mate. Your leg down, it doesn't nice look good mate. on camera. Um, I have a second date tonight. Nice. With who? A Shayna, the nurse. Ah, oh, poor her. Having to deal with the pandemic during the day and then deal with you in the evenings. You need a friend like yeah, that. Yeah, we're doing one of those, um, those quiz activities on the app. Ooh, hey, don't embarrass yourself, you know. Yeah, listen, you don't need to worry about my general knowledge, all right? Anyways, have you lot chatted otherwise? We haven't, but that's understandable, right? Yeah, definitely. She must be so busy right now. Consider yourself lucky. Mm. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm going to let you carry on with whatever it is that you're attempting to do. Uh, good luck. Uh, <laughs> I'll catch you later. Uh, on. Go on, I'll call you after. Join. If we can. Let's hope she's not too busy. It would be understandable in the pandemic for a nurse. It would be understandable any time for a nurse, to be honest, but especially during the pandemic. Ah, uh, maybe she's not here. <laughs> Honestly, people would say, well, if you're going to cancel, you should say something. And to an extent, that's true. Honestly, she's got a hell of a lot more on her mind than our little date. <laughs> hey, hey, no, 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 no. You must be the first guy ever to be stood up on a video date. <laughs> Shut up, man. Hey, no, hey, no, no, seriously, yeah, seriously. She must have been, like, called in early for an emergency shift exactly. or something like that, man. Yeah, but she could have just messaged on the app or something. Oh, busy, dude. Come on, man. She must be mad busy, mm -hmm. mad rushed. Or, or she wants me to take a hint. That's I... possible, but don't assume. I guess that might be true, I suppose. Yeah. No, no, sorry. You're not supposed to say it. You're supposed to go, no, 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 that's <laughs> definitely not true. Hey, hey, do you want the truth or do you want, do you want me blowing roses up your ass? Blowing smoke what do you up want? your ass. Truth or roses? Exactly. Roses, please. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if we can get in now. She's there. Shayna, hi. Hi. You right? Hi. Um, yeah, look, I want to say sorry for yesterday. I got called into work on an emergency shift. That's Listen, what I thought. I, I, I kind of guessed, so it's cool. Yeah. Yeah, still, still, but I'm sorry, and I hope you weren't too inconvenienced. Oh, my goodness. No, not at all. Um, how are you? Are you okay? Yeah. Shattered. Shattered, but good. Don't you look it? Shit happens. Shattered. Excuse my language. Good. <laughs> Good. You don't look shattered at all. You look Pieces of curse. No, I'm joking. I'm not buying it though. Um, uh, look, I might as well be upfront with you. My job has got like unsociable and unpredictable hours, and that's just going to be for the foreseeable future, which makes it really difficult to date. So I bet it does. I, I guess I understand if you can't be bothered with that. Just, um, it's just a shame because I was really looking forward to that quiz. So was I. I don't suppose you're free now. I absolutely am. Um, it would be petty to say no when so I don't I'm just have thinking about person. what's... Oh, no, sorry. You're probably busy. It's midday. People have things to do. Let's do it. Mm. Screw it. Yes. I'm up for it. Right, OK. What's the quiz topic? Uh, what, is it like general knowledge or...? Each other. <laughs> Ooh. As in us. Yep. You mean me and you, just after one day? Yep. I thought, what better way to get to know each other than to make educated guesses about what we're into? One of my favourite icebreakers, icebreakers being simple verbal games to play uh, in a party that don't know each other, uh, is two truths and one lie, where someone is the person up front and they tells two truths about themselves. Or two, two lies and one truth, sorry. Tells two lies about themselves and one truth. And you have to try and guess what the truth is. So this is similar, but a bit more simplistic. I like that kind of game. It can get spicy. Okay, fair enough. Let's give this a go. I'm done. I think the quiz will start if I just... 
There will be three questions, each with three answers. You must guess the other person's answer. The correct answer shall be revealed after each question. Okay. All right. Should I click the first one? Yeah. All right. Cool. Okay. Here we go. What is Shana's favorite holiday from Ooh. these options? Oh, have you picked? Yeah. You picked. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I've chosen mine. What do you think it is? No pressure. No Christmas, pressure. Diwali, or Halloween? Christmas is a stereotypical one. Uh, she's a nurse. I could. This is not true of all nurses by any means. I'm just trying to game the system here. Uh, I could see it not being her favourite holiday because that's one that can result in a lot of people being hospitalised through drunkenness, stupidity, and other things, uh, family fights, domestics, and so on. So I could see that possibly not being her favourite. Diwali, I believe she's Indian, but that's an assumption. It hasn't been stated. Um, she may well be Hindu. Um, so it could be that she's into the, uh, I think Diwali's Festival is of Lights, isn't it? Um, that's possible. And uh, I'm not sure when we heard her talking to her family, I think she might have spoken a little Hindi, but I'm not sure. Um, so that's a possible one from culture, but that might be a misleading. Halloween. Halloween shouldn't have a lot of people in hospital and he's off the beaten track. Um, but it can be a really fun holiday. I'm going to go Halloween. You sweated. So are you trash talking over a quiz? Sorry. Apologies. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know. I'm thinking the whole family wholesome vibe is sort of too obvious. So maybe I'll go with... Okay. Come on! Oh, very perceptive. I feel like you throw together a mean costume as well. Yeah, I, I do actually as well. I could like see her being expressive. I've got like glitter, sewing, sewing machine, face paint, a lot. No, well, she's off the beaten it's track. Good. She's <laughs> okay, got an adventurous turn, so spirit. Pick your answer and then I'll have a guess. Okay, go for it. Right. Question two. Yeah. Ooh, what is Billy's political outlook? Oh, shit. That's this is a British game, therefore I'm moderate. I'm answering from me. Ooh. In America, I'd be liberal. America's uh, political average is right of centre. Boom. Done. Right. I'm answering with my outlook. Let's see if they align. Nice. nice. Ooh. Well done. I mean, that's kind of, that's definitely avoided some awkwardness. Well, I'm pretty centrist, so I'm sure we'll align on most things. I think so. Loads of stuff we can get into at a later date, so... Good shout. Good shout Should indeed. I hit the next one? Yeah, go for I it. I might have said good okay, shout, right. but it would be a good chat. This one's good. Okay, what is Shayna most scared of? Easy. Oh, have you picked? Yeah, easy. Okay. Yeah, uh, <laughs> or spiders. Who isn't creeped out, at least, by spiders? Afraid of. Okay. You know my complaint on that one? A lot of people aren't necessarily scared of spiders. They're creeped out by it. You don't want to go near it because it's, ooh, creepy. It's a bit like you're not scared of a dirty diaper, but you don't want to pick it up. And others aren't actually scared of spiders. It's got to be these, then. Surely. Yes! Yes! Nice. <laughs> I hate even just talking about, oh, they make me, they actually make my skin crawl just thinking, oh, I can't even, I actually can't even talk about it. Yeah, she's more okay, creeped well, we, out we, by we, them. No, we'd make a good team. Why? Because I, yeah, I'm a good spider catcher. I thought you were going to say you love spiders and you'd help me. No, yeah, cool. You don't kill them, though, do you? No, no, I never kill them. I always catch them in like a cup. Interesting. So I she's also soft-hearted, which explains like being a nurse. I but I don't want people to get, oh. Not all nurses are like, soft-hearted. I think they're proper What is it that you don't like about them, though? Just, what, the, the legs, the look? Mm -hmm. Like, they're so creepy. What if they just come on your hair and, like, lay eggs in your head and they, ugh, ugh, <laughs> ugh. That's it. Dumb. This is the silly myth. No. Okay, question fine, we'll four, move on. Four. I'm about to move on. Uh, Vinny's favourite ice cream flavour. Okay, that's a nice one for me. <laughs> mm, none of them. Just of I'll say chocolate out of them. Okay, I could have this any day of the week. There we go. There you go. Now I know you've now you said it. There you go. You think vanilla? What? Do you think I'm bland? No, no I just thought I you. Okay, maybe. 
Okay. For man. your information, okay, I go for dark chocolate and the highest. Do you like some dark chocolate? Ooh, and the highest percentage. I hate dark chocolate. <laughs> There's a bit of bitterness in in dark chocolate that I just love. It feels too grown up, <laughs> even for me. So yeah, she's fun loving, like... adventurous. Do you not soft see me? Am I not grown? No, I would have. I would have thought you'd have said white chocolate, <laughs> baby's chocolate. Anyway. Into dress up. <laughs> Actually, underestimated you. Okay, good. I can't believe you think I'm bland. Okay, anyway, next. <laughs> okay. Oh Thinks my vanilla goodness. Vanilla's an underestimate. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah, shit. What is Shayna's favourite I said it could position? get spicy. <laughs> shit, I knew I should have given it permission for NSFW questions. Right. Rules are rules. Missionary right. doggy or cowgirl. Go She might be going for, she's got a sense of humor, she might be going for the referential joke. She saves lives as a nurse, missionaries in theory save lives or souls. Um, I'm not going to get into the religious as to whether that's true or not, but in theory. Uh, so that's a possibility. Doggy, I don't see it for her. Why would you want to look away? She's the kind of person who wants to look you dead in the eye. And the other was cowgirl. There are dress-up fantasies with Cowgirl, aside from the sexual position. Um, and it's a more adventurous style. I think that's what she's going to go for. Go on. Go on, tell yeah. us. Done. Done. You done. 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 You've chosen. Done. Yeah. I think yeah. it's the adventurous spirit, the, the like of something Don't different. Too hard. No, no, it's I'm fine. Not, but... Also, yeah. a dominant uh, female cool. position. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So you're a control freak, yeah? Well, actually, actually, my, my favourite position isn't even on there, so I went to the one that was the most fun on that link. What the hell are you doing out there? I actually, I actually shouldn't be talking. I, I forgot. Oh, your parents. Yeah, <laughs> your parents. <don't> <laughs> well, that could be. My oh, so did your, is, is yours like a silent move? Is that why it's not on there? Because it's like a silent move. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like a stare from across the room. Is that Jack like didn't bound. I've got it. <laughs> It's not actually a physical thing. It's like a. <laughs> as, you, as you get a bit older, you just prefer to connect on an emotional level. <laughs> I like <laughs> her. Whether to be really excited about this. I truly or like her. About this. And the actress you know? is perfect. <laughs> you, do. you know, you, Mister, don't need to be anything on a second date. So let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> okay, all right, Michelle, go for it. I'll go for it. Question six. Vinny's favourite time of day. Ooh, how gentile. Evening. What are these questions? I we I, okay, we cannot accuse you of not switching things up. The quiet. This is so polar the opposites. Okay. Privacy. Favourite time of day. The time yeah. with an intimate one being more likely to happen then. Oh, this is this. Although is not necessarily with a nurse. That you've got to get this. Okay, if you said it's no, if you said it's easy, I I've got it. Yes. <laughs> nice. Well done. <laughs> yeah, I'm a night owl for sure. I love the buzz and, and the, the quiet at night. And... And... Uh, <laughs> and I love talking to Shayna, obviously, because she's amazing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, whatever. Right, let's move. Oh. Okay, what, is that it? Oh, that's the end of the quiz. Oh, but that was yeah. fun. Okay, so what do we do? Do you find out who the winner is now? Yeah, well, obviously. Right, let's see. Okay, right. I'm not... Oh, gosh. How many points did I get? Oh, drum roll, please. Drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Come on! Oh, no fucking, no whip, no. Top marks. No, I'm not accepting that. I'm actually not accepting that because your questions were way easier than mine. <laughs> Are you a sore loser? No. <laughs> you don't like this at all, do you? You don't. <laughs> slightly, slightly. It's a little bit of gamer in me. Gamer too. I have to say it right. I actually have to say I'm really impressed. I think you might have. That got me figured out a little bit. Not entirely. Really? Not by a long way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I like what I see. And a gamer too. In all seriousness, a quiz was a great shout. Well done. Thank you. I absolutely love them. I just love them. I'm a bit of a wannabe brainiac at the best of times. Always want to get top grades. Mm. Always want to be the know-it-all. I can believe but it. But do you think that comes from your parents? When your family? Mm, yeah. It was sort of like ingrained in me. And... I think I'd be the same with my kids and their academics. Mm -hmm. Do you know what? It's expensive these days. I mean, if you want to go into higher education, I mean. 
tell me about it. Like my parents got off lightly with me and my sister because that we got bursaries and scholarships, mm -hmm. which we, we wouldn't have been able to do without it. Well, listen, it seems like they did a fine job on you guys. Yeah. Thank you. Do you, do you want kids? Ooh, Shana. Oh, sorry. Ah. Sorry. So big, wow, bold question there. No, it out. is, no, but... Uh, maybe now, maybe yeah. later, but so not not rush for it, but yes. In okay, my I, case, I'm no. I'm definitely getting there, but there's just so many things but I want to achieve case. and experience before fatherhood. Yeah, but you're not, you're, not, you're not far away from it. No, a few years maybe, but not right now. Yeah, well, that actually makes complete sense where you are in life. Because once you do it, that's it. You're raising this kid forever. And not that I'm old, but that's why I've waited, because it has to be the right, has to be right with the person. right person. Yeah. In the right circumstance. Shana? Oh. Shana? Sorry. Shopping yeah. Right, sorry, I need to go for the weekly food shop, and I'm not sure when I'll get the next chance. Work Absolutely. Stuff, so. Yeah, no, 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 no. I understand. Uh, priorities. I'm really glad that you were able to carve out this time for us. And it's probably best that we wrap up for now because, again, it was starting to head in a really serious direction. Uh, yeah, true, but that's yeah, fine. I understand, it's fine. And this was all so fun. Thanks, Vinny. Right, well then, um, enjoy the rest of your day. You too, Shana. You too. Right, bye. See you later, bye bye. Too. I think we have a winner winner chicken dinner here. That's cool that she made up for last night. Yeah, I've, and I've never had a lunch date before. Oh, okay. So, uh, how'd it go? If I had to sum up the date, Callum, it was great. It was... Okay. And the, the quiz was really fun. And listen, even though we didn't have that much time together, I think we really bounced off each other. Do you know? It sounds like she's really cool, man. Yeah, it all seems very chill and comfortable. And I could definitely see my... Self and her progressing. Wow, damn, you're saying a lot. It's like two dates. That's, that's a lot. Not yeah. a lot, but yeah. Get your thinking cap on, man. You got some decisions to make. Mm. I do some big ones, some important ones. Listen, I'm gonna head to bed, but I'll catch you tomorrow or something. All right, done, man. Sweet, bro. Have a good sleep. All right, cool, man. Good night. Peace. Thank you. Second date with Seth has been scheduled for this evening. Game date. She's chosen tarot reading. I'm all right. I have a brief knowledge of tarot, but not much. Um, Shayna. From what I would think, that's a winner winner chicken dinner, but it's not. She's not going to be for everyone, not by a long, long way. Apart from she's got an obvious desire for children in the non too distant future, which not everyone's going to be into. Um, the scheduling. It's like a long distance relationship. Some people just cannot handle it. Me, my first fiance, my late wife, and my wife, we're all from international relationships. I can't. Me, I can have time without a person as long as I've got quality time with them. But some need that 24 7 feeling. It's all on the individual. With her scheduling, you're not going to have that. She's a hard-working nurse. She's got ambition. You're going to have quality time, and apparently a lot of fun, when you've got time with her. But it's going to be getting that time with her. From my perspective, and how I'm playing Vinny, it's a winner winner chicken dinner. I said, in my mind, he's... I said creative, I said he's a YouTuber. He can get on with making his videos, he can get on with editing, he can get on with uh, keeping up with the fan base or the viewers, um, and so on and so forth. And plug that into all the other time. Make sure she's got a, you know, her favourite cocktail, things like that. Perfect. Right. Of course. Right where I expect you to be. Bro, I've been killing these kill streaks recently, fam. So, listen, I've got my second date with Saffron tonight. <laughs> nice work. What's the game? Uh, I think tarot, tarot reading, tarot reading. I think there's... Oh, um, those cards that people use to tell their future. That's yeah. the one, that's the one. Yeah, I'm kind of Good just degree. approaching it with an open mind. It's the best way to be, bro. Have you chatted since the first date? You're going to hate me, but... <laughs> She's actually sent me a vegan recipe over the app, and I'm cooking it right now. Like it's a cauliflower curry. 
Oh, wouldn't mind trying. <laughs> Actually, smells pretty uh, good enough. You know what? Call me later, vegan. <laughs> Uh, get your cucumber ass out of it. Alright, cool. I'll show you in a bit. I'll let you know how it tastes. Bye. I love me some meat, but um, I'm not averse to eating vegetarian meals now and then. I do love me some meat, though. This probably wouldn't be good for me. Well, she has a fine butt. Fuck. Knock, knock. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I thought I'd better be early because of last time. No, 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 you're all right. Oh, and thank you for doing a tarot reading, by the way. I oh. like was looking at the other games. And I was just like, I think this will be a little bit different. Yeah, listen, I don't know much about it, but I'm a willing guinea pig. You are in for a treat, young man. Okay, should we just do this? I'm quite excited. Yes. Okay. So this. Is my tarot deck. Nice. I'm not sure if that's a tradition um, right away tarot or Tarot deck should be like really personal to their owner. Um, it sort of acts mm -hmm. as a vessel of their energy to give like an authentic reading. So like kind of like um, an energy sponge. Yeah. I mean, there are very different types of readings that you can do. Um, but for today, I'm just going to do like a simple general reading that goes into your past, present and future. Do you know what? Sorry, I thought that they only told the future. That no. is a common misconception. They actually don't tell you anything um, at all, really. <laughs> it's more, hey, no, they just like bring up stuff in your life um, <laughs> that you can sort of delve into and consider. Cool, listen, let's just get delving. Okay, so um, the- Honestly, a good tarot reader isn't so much a fortune teller, more use it for inspiration to ask questions, um, they're the more convincing ones who are charlatans as well, but it's also, if someone's into that kind of thing, a better way to use it to generate questions, ask, uh, ask, learn, and let the person reflect. Um, most salaries will tell you the future not set anyway, so. The first two cards I pick out are going to pertain to your past. Okay. Now, I'm not saying I believe tarot no. works, I'm just... Reflecting from my <laughs> knowledge that I do have. Okay. Okay. Which card are you more drawn to? The moon? Or the page of or coins? Or the page of pentacles? Okay. And, pentacles uh, you're points. not going to give me any tips, right? Like, you're not going to tell mm -hmm. me which one's better. And uh, moon is right. illusion and Mr. Pentacles not is a lower card okay, uh, of the materials. Page side. of pentacles. Oh, I love this card. Okay. Upright or... Reverse. Almost always upright. Reverse sense make it a more Ooh, negative intense. Um... <laughs> hmm. Let's go upright. Yeah, upright? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, 100%, <laughs> okay. I'm sure. So this way up, the Page of Pentacles represents ambition, diligence, and desire. This sounds good. Do those themes feature heavily in your past? It could be in you or in others around you. Engage. This is a time to engage this. with her. They, yeah, they did actually. Um, I had a really good friend uh, back in school and he used to beat me in all of these tests, but he used to let me copy his homework. Oh, well, well done for him for sharing the wealth. Oh, no, exactly. I mean, without him, I honestly would have failed all of my exams. <laughs> I, rem I remember asking him how he got so smart, and he said he wasn't. He just worked harder than everybody else. So he kind of raised the bar for me. So instead of trying to copy him all the time, I decided to compete with him to try and match this kid's amazing, amazing brain. <laughs> kind of got about the same grades, I think. That's so great. And he was, yeah, he was just super excited that we had succeeded together, so. Mm, I love that. He taught me that drive and ambition can be collaborative. Yes. And that was a, I think that's a really important lesson. It is. Yeah. Too many think it's just competitive, it can be both. He, uh, he passed away last year. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. He really made a big impact on my life, so. You know, that's a common phrase, but a strange one. I'm sorry to hear that. Not I'm sorry it happened. I'm sorry that I heard it. 
That's not how it's intended, but the basis I guess, we thank you for reminding me of that wonderful time and him and that memory. That's a winner with her. So this is my present. It is indeed. Okay. All right. Okay, Lightning the tower, tower or the two of swords. Oh, two of swords. Ooh, they look dangerous. Cards. I'll go for two of swords. Lightning stricken um, tower is disaster, downfall. I'm not sure like what the two, two of swords, swords are. Two of swords tends to be combative. Yeah, I'm going with that. So, oh, this is actually my favourite card. <gasps> upright or reversed? Uh, upright, always, as I said. Oh, God, I always get nervous picking this one for some reason. I think upright. Upright? Upright, yeah. I think that's okay. the right weight. <laughs> Okay, so this card tells me that your current self is riddled with indecisions, personal combat inside, solutions, and difficulties. Mm -hmm. Is any of that ringing a bell? Okay, well, there's a lot going on there. Um, yeah. Yeah. They don't necessarily need to apply to you, could be okay. others around you, or yeah. Okay, it's funny. I've had a few indecisions this week which on the face of things seem pretty insignificant, but in reality, the, the solutions I choose could potentially shape what is... You're talking about this dating app. Yeah, he's talking thing. about this dating app. Am I that obvious? <laughs> oh, it's silly to take these things too serious, I know, but... <laughs> Not at all. I mean, anyone you meet on a dating app has the potential to impact your whole exactly. life, so... I agree, I think so too. Yeah. Literally, like forever, like you never know who mm. you're gonna meet. So. It may be a brief thing that about yourself. Like that true. I mean, this is a good example of that. So, <laughs> okay, my guess about my future is as good as yours. So, I guess this is where the real mysticism starts, right? Wow, these are just like feelings I get. Um, you know, maybe they'll just focus your attention on an outcome you'll want to like achieve or avoid. Sure. Okay. <sighs> It makes me nervous when you do that. That was this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Swords again. So seven of cups or the four of wands. Four, of, this... four of wands or seven of cups. Four um, of wands. What do you like the look of? I, I'm not sure on those two. I don't really know okay. the lower I can. Purely for the magic, I'm going with four of wands. Four of wands. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> Upright or reversed? Upright. I feel like they kind of look the same, but you just got to go with what you feel. Okay, upright. Upright? Do you think upright? Yeah, I don't know. You yeah, yeah. <laughs> upright? Upright. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. This is actually a really lovely one. Um, Good. I see peace, happiness, and harmony encompassing all aspects of your life. This is great. You like that one? <laughs> It's hard to imagine this now, but this pandemic will come to an end mm -hmm. and life will go on. And I have, I have just every intention of working towards the goal you just described. Wow. Yeah, I think that's amazing that you think that that's like achievable. A lot of people don't think that they'll like ever attain it. I don't know why. No, I agree. And I think this time, this period of time that we're in now, that can do that to you. But yeah, to come totally. out maybe with a, a bit of optimism, which is so cringy, I know, to say, but... Just some hope, do you know what I mean? Well, thanks for being so open with me with this stuff. Um, not everyone is. No, it was all pretty insightful, I have to admit. I learned a lot about you. Good stuff, I hope. Oh, exclusively. Okay, good. <laughs> you, um, you articulate your emotions well. well that's cool, that's good to, that's good to know. <laughs> and see, that's what I was saying about how some people used to follow at least. She didn't tell him anything at all. She proposed questions which allowed him to give answers. Okay, I'm not allowing this whole date to be about me. What? It hasn't. Okay, listen, what we're doing now is we're going to switch roles. You want to do a reading on me? Yep. <laughs> and we're just going to see what we come up with and you can laugh at me if you want. Okay, you don't have a deck? Ah, oh, shit. 
<laughs> okay, how about you pick a card and then I'll, inter <laughs> I'll interpret it for you. Well, that is not how this works. You kind of is. But no, I hate Let's your way to See what we get. Who knows? I might actually be really good at this. So, yeah, sure. Maybe. Okay, yeah, you shuffle them. It's not going to be me, that breathing thing that you do that. <laughs> oh, past. We're doing past this? I know. Panic attack. Wake up, boy. Have fun. Saffron, are you okay? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm not okay, I'm not okay. I'm so Focus her on the room. I'm so hot, I'm so hot. Breathing and the room. Breathing and the room. Breathing and the room. He's in a panic attack. Saffron, is there any is it Don't Saffron. lose it. Come on, breathe. Breathe with me, Saffron. Breathe with me. You'll get through, it's a panic attack. But focus and breathe. Okay, Saffron, listen to me, right? You're fine. You're fine, I promise you. No, I'm not, I'm gonna die. Breathe, don't tell her she's fine. It's not going to work right now. You're not gonna die, okay? I'm not gonna go anywhere. I'm gonna stay right here on the other side of this call, okay? It's a panic attack, you'll get through it. Focus her. I'm right here. Focus her. Keep talking, focus her. Breathe. Help her breathe. That's it, just breathe. Yes, breathe. Even guided, breathe in, breathe out. Stay as long as you need, okay? I'm right here. Good reassurance. Good reassurance. As someone who's never done this before, you're doing well. I'm so sorry, Vinny. Nothing to be sorry about. I'm so embarrassed. No reason to be. You had a panic attack. Honestly, don't be, all right? We've all got shit to deal with, and the support is what's most important. So I'm just... I'm just nice move, Vinny. Nice statement. Not move. That sounds like it's a plan. Nice statement. Nice reaction. Thank you for staying. <laughs> You'll be unkind. I'm... No. But I understand supportive. that this is all too much for you. Please don't even think about it. On okay? a second day as well. That's fine. Um, Listen, why don't you just go chill out, get some rest? Yeah, sorry. I'm I'm just going to go to bed. It's fine. You're a gem. Um, good night. Good night, Saffron. And take care of yourself, yeah? Fuck, man. How did he even know how to deal with a panic attack? I, I didn't. I guess I just... I, I did what I would want in that scenario, which is not be left alone. Bingo! Hey, you are a top, top man for that, man. Well done. Seriously. I just hope she's okay, man. I hear that, man. But what a difficult thing to have to struggle with, you know? Look, obviously, this is something you have to consider whether you can handle or not. Of course. Um, I have to be all in. It wouldn't be fair to either of us otherwise. Mm. So, how was the date going before that? <laughs> I have to say that it was going great. Hey. Um, she's into some really different stuff, but I, Callum, I just, I, I love it. And I think that I'll really broaden my horizons with her. Wow. <laughs> I never thought that I would hear those words coming out of your mouth, bro. That's big. Neither did I, but mm. I had a lot to learn from her, and hopefully she had something to learn from me, but... I don't know what she's going to learn from you, but yeah. 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 Man, that's good, man. <laughs> I think you could actually learn a lot from me, and, uh, you know... Oh, is it? <laughs> <sighs> All right, man. Hey, I'm hitting the sack, man. <laughs> You've got some things to do tomorrow, and I hope that goes well for you. Mm. Yeah, I back myself. Hmm. So what do you need me for? Everything else. Everything <laughs> else in my life. Yes. I need. That's right. That's right. <laughs> nah, as always, I appreciate you, man. Love, man. Take care, man. Yeah, I shall. Right. Peace. Bye-bye. Mm. That made it difficult. Send one invitation for a third day. 
Wow. I mentioned the difficulty with Shana's, um, Shana's schedule. Saffron's panic disorder is going to be a complete off for a lot of people. Now, let me be very clear here. I suffer from anxiety and depression. I have mental health challenges. I do not find it offensive that someone cannot deal with it. Fine. I understand that. Let's just be friends or go our separate ways. But I also know that... And they do say two people with mental illness cannot be together. That's absolute bullshit. As long as they can find a way to be careful around each other's eggshell, uh, each other's eggshell areas, the areas where we're weak, we can actually have an understanding that others don't. That if you can stay stable at that time, you can truly help the other person get through a panic time, an anxiety time, a depression time, finding ways to help them and supporting them and so on. Now, if that's all you're doing, if it's all one way, that's bad. Um, but you can help each other be stronger because you've got a knowledge of what's going on. That whole thing, I'm fine with that. I want to select Saffron, but I won't. And it's not because of the mental health issue. That is not, as I think I've made clear, remotely and off for me. If you don't believe that, I'm not going to talk about anything with my current wife. Um, and she's open about being autistic. That's not a mental health issue. That's a neurodivergence. But my late wife... Depression, anxiety, um, dissociative identity disorder, it worked perfectly. Perfectly, as perfect as any relationship between two people works. I'm not going to say there weren't ever issues. Of course there were. We're human beings. Yes, it can work. That's not an offer. I'd like to stay friends with Saffron. She's fun. But let's face it, Shayna is family loving, fun, um, open minded, let's just say that. Uh a giver, um a, a gamer as well. What is there not to love about Shayna? And I say even this even the um issue with uh timetables or that uh, scheduling, um with how I designed Vinny, saying he's a YouTuber, that could work too. Gives him plenty of time for his own online work. I have to choose Shayna, but Saffron has gone up in my appreciation a lot. And the fact that when she came out of that, she was grateful and not so embarrassed she wanted to run away. I'm not saying that you should just be cowering someone. Oh my God, you saved me! No, that's bullshit. But it's hard. It's easy when you're embarrassed to just say, "Go away." She had the strength to say, "I'm past that. Thank you." That's a strength. This is hard. I'm going to decline saffron because there's been no way I couldn't select Shayna. Wait, what? Did I accidentally delete both of them? No! No! And I can't reload. Oh, God. I, that's the one bad part of program. It was lit up on Saffron till I click decline. I thought it was going to decline Saffron. I apologise for that very screwed up ending. That was not where I intended to go. Unfortunately, I missed out on the last date with Shayna. Let's say she was too busy and it fell apart. Now, tomorrow, I believe, 10 dates launches. I'm going to buy it. This intrigued me. So if you're interested, join us then.
and we'll start 10 dates. And again, I am really sorry I screwed up there. That's embarrassing. Very well.